What's up, everybody? I really don't have anything much to say today, but uh, wish everybody a happy Labor Day. If you celebrate Labor Day with your family and friends and co-workers or schoolmates. Um, just want to say, again, happy Labor Day. i not really planning a vlog today. But, hope you guys are having a blessed day today. Um, I know some states, the schools have started, and other states, I think school starts tomorrow. So, I just want to wish everybody a happy, good school year, and get some good passing grades. And, again guys, stay in school. And if this year, going into next year, if this is your last year of high school, or even middle school going into high school, just think, pick your right classes from middle school to high school. Pick the right classes so you can get them done quick. So your senior year, you can focus on figuring out what kind of college courses you want to do and what kind of side jobs you want to do if this is your last year. But like I said, if you're an 8th grader or a ninth grader going into high school, no matter what state and city you're in for the schools, uh, focus on getting all the hard courses done first if you're going into 10th grade or 9th grade. Um, the faster you get it done, get all your electives done, um, the easier your life's going to be your senior year or even your junior year. So, again, guys, really don't have a vlog. It's just wishing everybody the best of luck this year if you're entering high school or you're leaving high school. Now, if this is their first time into college, I really can't help you there because... Really, I didn't go to school for college. I barely went to high school myself. No, I'm not a failure. It's just... Look, the road I took isn't the road you want to take. So, I'm letting you guys know that don't make the mistakes that I did. Make, even if you're not the... The brightest light bulb on that string of lights. Just try like I did. And just focus on your work. Don't focus on video games and all these other videos. And don't focus on social media. There's only two things you should be focused on. Well, three things you should be focused on. Yourself your family, and your school. And then if you have a side job, then your side job. But besides that, that's the only thing you should be focusing on. Yourself, your schooling, your family, and your workplace. That's it. And once you focus on all this stuff, once you get done with school, you focus on yourself, and your family, and your workplace. Because worrying about others, worrying about what other people are doing. Now, I'm not saying all videos are bad. I'm not saying all video games are bad. But make sure you get your stuff done before doing other things. Because if you don't, I don't know. See, this wasn't even supposed to be a vlog. This is one thing supposed to be a video, but I get into making stuff, and I just just keep on going. This is what motivates me. This is what keeps me going, guys, is you. It don't matter the views. It doesn't really matter how many subscribers I got. It's just I'm happy that one person out of a billion people on this planet who has the Internet sits down 
and listens to the things I say. Now, if that person has something to say, that person thinks this channel can grow by their comment, let me know. Tell your friends, your family members, your co-workers about my channel. Because everything I tell you folks, I try my best. And I try to say it was a positive answer. Now, I don't know if you guys are into, you know, like wrestling. Like WWE, AEW, NXT. I'm into that kind of stuff. I love wrestling. I love it for what they do as wrestlers. What they do for the community. What they do for charity work. What they do for us. And, you know, I, yeah, I know. Don't I understand. It's, it's not real wrestling. But it's not that the wrestling isn't real. It's still a lot. Them guys still, them, well, populations grown with men and women in the ring. Some of the women, I think, are stronger than the men. Whew. And that does not even hurt. I'm telling these girls are kicking some butts, pulling some hair, black eyes, bloody noses, broken arms, broken shoulders, broken fingers. Man, I can't believe. I mean, I didn't get to watch the pay-per-view of AEW. I believe All Out, I believe it's called. Oh, my God, them women. Oh, suplexing off the top rope. And them type ropes are probably, what, four foot tall, five foot tall? On top of the women are five some are six feet tall, and you suplex them. Your legs are like 13, 14 feet in the air. Time your legs land, and the time your head lands from getting suplexed, you're nine feet. On top of your legs, now there's three, a foot and a half, two feet up taller. So literally, if you get a strong woman, she's on top of the rope, and she's suplexing. Even a, a smaller suplex, even at 12 feet, Oh, my locals, God, it's scary. And you're, I'm telling you, your back's got to hurt. Your neck's got to hurt. Your head's got to hurt. I don't care. It takes a lot of training just to learn every single move. And there's new moves coming out every month. They learn new stuff. And, and it's not even every month. It could be every other day, every couple of days. It really don't matter. And NXT is growing. It's growing so much. Honestly, I think sometimes it's better than the main roster on Raw and SmackDown. Because of what NXT is going through. They're breaking them even harder. So, you, you know, you start at smaller divisions and you work your way up. Yes, I know there's other corporations than just WWE, NXT. I know NXT is WWE, but still, I know there's other corporations than just AEW. There's all these smaller gyms. You can learn how to wrestle. I mean, I know that even the older wrestlers are doing their own little corporations. Now, I'm not going to say any names or anything like this, but... Because I'm not, I don't want to be wrong, but I know it. One time, the Hot Foundation, they had a uh, arena. Um, Dusty Rhodes, he had arena. Burger King, I now just found out, he has arena. John Cena, Randy Orton, they got their own workout centers. I believe Seth Rollins has his own workout center. So these, these wrestlers are not just going out there making movies, making 
wrestling TV shows, the pay-per-views, not only the donating their time to your communities, helping foundations, finding cheers for cancers. They're out there training people how to work out correctly and how to wrestle correctly and safely. And telling people drugs don't work. Alcohol doesn't work. Steroids. Well, that is what kind of steroids you're talking about. If you're using a steroid to get stronger, then it could be a no-no. But if you're using steroids to get stronger because you have surgery and it's recommended by the doctors, then that's a whole different world. But if you're taking steroids to bulk up, then, then, then that might be a problem for your corporation. But if your corporation allows the doctor to approve swords to get you back in the ring faster and healthier and better than you were even before you got hurt, then you do that. But but don't take steroids just because you think you're better than everybody else. You don't do that. Even same going back to the schooling thing. All because you're the smartest person in the world. You don't need to make fun of other people because you're smarter. Because you can read better, you can spell better, you can figure out math problems better, you can figure out science questions, math questions, English questions, history questions better, or you can cook better, or you can cut better, or weld better, or build better, or fix a car better, or whatever, a mechanic, you're a better mechanic, it doesn't matter. Everybody has their own values, their own values of life, all because you can make a better video than somebody, you don't make fun of that person. Oh, because you can play better video games than someone. Don't make fun of that person. Because I want to tell you something. Maybe they're playing the way they want to play. To test you. That's something to think about, too. It doesn't matter if they don't play wrestling games. They may love the sport, but they may not like the game. Think about that.